We're in a taxi, headed to breakfast at a restaurant called Macareno. And highly rated on Yelp, so uh, let's head out there. Como te llamas? Luis. Luis. We're going with Luis, guys. In today's video, we are going to have an amazing breakfast at a delicious local restaurant called Macareno. And wait until you see the size of these burritos and hear what the cafe de olla tastes like. And after breakfast, you're going to want to hit that subscribe button and keep on watching because I meet an incredible 12 year old boy with a story that is going to leave you so impressed you don't want to miss it. And lastly, we hit up Puerto Vallarta's number one rated day spa, Metamorphosis, where we go for a 90 minute couples massage. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let us know your thoughts on the little boy and are you guys booking a massage? All right, guys, we made it to our restaurant and we are paying 80 pesos. Espera ti, todo. Gracias. Tenga buen día. Right here is where we're headed, guys. Macareno Las Guerras. All right, let's go in and eat. Hola, buen día. ¿Cómo estás? Right here, the shade. As we're here at the restaurant, let's take a look at the menu. It is a breakfast lover's paradise here. I may be looking at a breakfast burrito, to be honest with you guys. Can I have the uh, plain chilaquiles? Plain chilaquiles, okay. Yo quiero el burrito, por favor. Okay, what you guys? We got the green juice here. These look so yummy. Very nice presentation, and let's see how they taste. These are good. Wow. wow. You just taste how good they are for you. Not only do they have flavor, but you can just feel the nutrients and all the greens. All right, travelers, if you haven't figured this out, I need my coffee in the morning. And as you could see, we have this nice little spread here. Uh, this is cafe de olla, which basically is coffee in a pot. Um, the coffee is just a black coffee with cinnamon. Uh, they use this dark sugar cane. I've had this before at another restaurant that's actually called cafe de olla, very good restaurant. Uh, but here they also serve it and they have this cute little milk container and some little biscuit things on the side to have which was similar to where where i had this the last time so i'm going to go ahead and mix this together should be a little bit of sweetness in this already so i'll just pour the milk inside give it a nice little stir so it's just like a little spice coffee give it a shot Uh, it's just a really deep uh, coffee flavor and the spice of the cinnamon is wonderful. It's a nice complement to this with the cream and there's just enough sugar. You don't really need any uh, added sugar to this. So if you're lucky enough to find this in Mexico, it's usually um, in these mom and pop type uh, restaurants. Uh, look for Cafe de Olla and order it. You'll love it. It's the tropical bread. It's a French toast with what, maybe? It has like, I think it's a passion fruit pineapple glaze with fresh fruit and like a cinnamon type of mousse that's on it. It looks delicious. Give this a try and let's see how good this really is. God, for this food, for this day, for being in a life, to blessing us with each other, for this wonderful vacation, and for the ability to bless us. Okay, here we go. It's soft. Yes. It has a sugary exterior. Good? Mm -hmm. It's good. I'm just trying to get the flavor mm. that stands out the most. A blend of flavors. You got the French toast, it kind of tastes like a bready churro, and then you got the, the glaze on top. How would you describe that? It's just well, the bread is really soft, it looks like it may be dense, but it's very light, and it has fruity notes. I think it's from the passion fruit, and I think it was either pineapple or mango but it's just a nice, light, sweet type of breakfast pastry. This is my breakfast burrito, guys. Look at that, with bacon on it. 
two different color sauces. Got half in red and half in green. And it looks delicious. I don't know how I'm gonna eat it all, but I will. So I'm gonna try mine while we wait for Vanessa's. So I'm gonna start here with the red side. Look at how good this bacon looks, you guys. Nice and thick. Let's dig in. You see the inside looks delicious. You got eggs, tomato, veggies, some cheese, black beans, and then the Really good. Nothing is overpowering. It's just nice, soft, fluffy eggs, a nice soft tortilla. You get a nice taste of the bacon. Like it's perfect, perfect balance in this. Now I'm gonna try it with some of the salsa here. Let's see how it tastes with a little bit of spice. All right, guys, wish me luck. I don't know how spicy this is. It's like wrapped in bacon, you guys. So every bite you take, this has bacon. Here, watch this, here we go. As the locals would say, excelente. Perfect spice, not too hot, not mild at all. You feel it, but you want more. When Vanessa's food gets here, she's gonna give you the same review. Chilaquiles de res con Igual en la noche tenemos tacos de seis hasta la Okay, so from 6 to 1 a.m. They also have tacos here, you guys. Now Vanessa got her food. All right, everybody. So I am still searching for a really, really good chilaquiles, so why not, right? Um, this is the chilaquiles verde, so it's the green sauce. Uh, it has black beans. I think this is the cotija cheese, um, some crema on there, pickled onions, and the special thing about this place is they have toppings. So anything that you order, there's a list of different uh, toppings, meat selections that you can uh, choose from. In my case, I chose the berilla. Uh, so that's what's listed on here. And there's two pieces of toast here, which I'll probably skip because I wanna save my calories for later, but let's give this a shot. The meat looks super tender. Oh, mm -hmm. wow. Not only is the salsa verde really rich in flavor, freshness, but this meat, guys, this is the first time that I've ever had meat on chilaquiles. It is so tender, very juicy, and they just put a nice helping on top of the chilaquiles. So, Come out, explore, enjoy. Our taxi driver didn't even know that this place existed. So hopefully through this, and if you subscribe and like our channel, we'll get more people here to keep this restaurant going. So I'm gonna keep eating guys. We are done with our meal here. I'm in the jungle. And uh, as you can see, we had quite a bit of food. Vanessa got her uh, chilaquiles. I got the burrito and we shared the French toast. We had three green drinks. I had two, she had one. All of that came out to 635 pesos. So let's do some quick conversion for you. 16 to one is our conversion rate. 635 divided by 16. So for that breakfast, $39, almost let's just call it $40. Well worth it. Vanessa said those were some of the best chilaquiles she's ever had in her life. I'll tell you what, I've never had a wet breakfast burrito. So that was a new experience and a delicious experience. And the green juice was great. We love green juice in Mexico. It just revitalizes you and gets you going for the day. Kind of helps restore some nutrients that we're not getting. We're eating a lot of tacos, to be honest with you. And uh, there's not a lot of greens. So having the green juice really helps give you that, those vitamins that uh, you crave, your body wants. But with that being said, travelers, we're gonna continue our day. It is going to be fun. We finished our breakfast and it was delicious. Look at right here, guys. We found a tortilla factory. This is where they make all the, you see all the corn and flour goes inside there and then it goes down the conveyor belt and it comes out right there. Nice and fresh. 
I bet those are delicious. So we're on our way to Metamorphous Day Spa, and that's where we're going to be getting our 90-minute massage. And I just asked my love, what were the ratings? Because she's very particular about where we go. And she looks at their stars and their ratings when it comes to this stuff. When it comes to other things, we will go to the biggest hole in the wall, most un inviting place that we can and we usually find gems and treasures in those places but when it comes to our bodies and uh, cleanliness we like to go for what's already been rated by other people so we know that we're going to be safe number one and we're walking into a clean environment so metamorphous spa is the number one rated spa in puerto vallarta and uh if they're not that expensive, you guys. For two 90 minute massages, what are we paying? It's about 1500 pesos. I think it's about $100. So we're paying about 100 US dollars. No, it's got to be a little more. We paid our last massage was $100 for the two of us. And this one's a little more. So maybe it's like 110, 120. It's not much more. Yeah, it wasn't much. If you're in town and you want to relax, check out Metamorphous Spa. Look at how tough this little guy is. He's carrying three gallons of orange juice and he's got one hanging on his front that he looped his shirt through and is holding his shirt up with his teeth. Now that right there is a tough kid. Hey, tú de dónde eres? Aquí. ¿Cuántos años tiene? Doce. Doce? Ok. ¿Y no hay, no hay escuela hoy? Sí, pero tal Ah, ok. ¿A qué hora empiezas? ¿O sí? Wow. Entonces van tarde, ¿ah? ¿eh? Sí. ¿Y qué hora terminan? ¿Sí? Wow. ¿Y eso es para tu familia? No. Oh. Oh, sí. Oh, ella, ella lo vende. Ah, ok. Y también lo hace. Todo eso de, de tu mamá lo hizo. Wow. Ok. Entonces tú lo estás uh, um, llevando a las clientes de ella. Ok. Wow. ¿Y qué deportes uh, te gustan? ¿A dónde vas? Vamos por aquí. Ah, también nosotros. Oh. A dos cuadras más y a la derecha. Ok. También nosotros. Dos cuadras y a la izquierda. ¿Qué deportes te gustan? Me gusta la barbería, cortar pelo. ¿O oh, sí? ¿Ya, ¿Ya empezaste practicando? Ya. ¿Sí? Sí, pero lo más bien de los sábados. Sí, claro. ¿Y ya, ya estás um, haciendo barbería? Sí. ¡Wow! ¿Tienes clientes y todo? Sí. Wow. ¿Y cuánto tiempo llevas haciendo eso? Tres meses. ¿O oh, sí? ¿Y cómo te va? Gracias. ¿Bien? Wow, qué bueno. Entonces un día tú vas a tener tu propio barbería. Sí. Donde tú vas a ser el jefe. Sí, si Dios quiere. Nos encanta. Siempre, siempre venimos. Bueno. No siempre, pero tratamos de venir como cada tres meses para por lo menos una semana. Pero es uh, muy lindo aquí. La gente es muy amable. ¿Te gusta vivir en Puerto Vallarta? Sí. Oh, yeah. ¿Dónde vamos? Yo aquí los dejo. Aquí, ok, porque nosotros vamos ahí a cruzar la calle. Okay, special delivery. Un placer. Okay, adios. <laughs> I'm not sure if you heard that conversation, but that little kid is awesome. He's 12 years old and uh, his mom makes all that juice and then he delivers it to their clients for her. Um, and then he goes to school at 1.45 in the afternoon until 8.45 at night. But get this, the kid's 12. He wants to be a barber when he gets older. 
and he's been cutting hair for the last three months on Saturdays he works at a barber shop so not only does he hustle and help his mom in the morning but he's got aspirations and he's going to school let's wish that kid a bunch of luck and here we are guys we've arrived at the metamorphosis day spa you can see they're open Monday to Saturday 10 to 5 and if you want to book a massage you just come here and on the wall they have all the massage therapists and their schedule and you just pencil yourself in so here we go hola como estas wow full house today hola so this is the metamorphosis spa you guys good morning hola good how are you all right so here you guys see this is the inside of the spa right here very very nice staff very very nice inside so we'll take you up and we'll let you see what we're doing here in a little bit okay gracias all right guys we're going in for our massages okay oh. oh it's in the same room oh okay okay <laughs> okay guys we are going to start our massages see there's vanessa over there and here's me start so we turn this on all right we are leaving the spa and my love what'd you think uh, one of the best massages i've had in a long time yeah it was great i mean if she felt the knot she worked it with her hands her elbow everything and just everything feels so good right now huh loose and just relaxed yeah oh, so nice check them out give them a good review if you do come let them know tv travel sent you there's their address 159 they've been here since 1996